So there are three components to what we're, well, four really, components to this trip of ours and what we're moving down the road. So mm -hmm. that is the Ram, the four wheel camper flatbed Hawk on the back of that, which then tows the Toy Hauler 610, which is hauling the General 1000 XP by Polaris, which is the brand new 2020 version that they sent us. Okay, so the Prospector will tow the TH610, the Patriot Camper Toy Hauler 610, 6.1 meters in length. That's the designation. Uh, it's great for the two-door side-by-side. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you are gonna be hauling something bigger, they do make a 730, a 7.3 meter tray yep. on the back. Uh, but this is the 610. And you've seen us use it in the Great Pursuit series last year. It hauled our powered paragliders and a motorcycle, mm -hmm. etc. This thing is like towing a garage. I think this is one of the coolest pieces of the kit that Expedition Overland has. It is so versatile. We use it for so much stuff. Yeah. Uh, and I remember uh, Justin and Sarah saying, yeah, you need one of these in your yeah. <laughs> in your fleet. And now that we have one, it, it's amazing. We just use it for so much stuff. Yep. Hauling ADV motorcycles, now it's hauling side-by-side. -side. Just whatever you want to go do. Oh, we put boats on it one day, yep. kayaks, yep. and we just hauled it down to the lake. It's just, we use it a lot. Uh, it's a very cool piece of kit. So, <clears throat> let's see. This will carry 40 gallons of water for us, mm -hmm. which is in the galley, and I'll let you talk about that in a minute. We've got the man cave in the front, which we have a grill on. Um, and then it's gonna be carrying some of our gold prospecting stuff as well. And then last year, uh, we went, this was all, we didn't really utilize the sink that much in the galley because this was all for helmets and we still have the system and we're waiting on our fridge yeah. to come in. Comms. All of our comms and our helmets and our radios were charged in here. This will get disconnected and the fridge will go in here this year. You're seeing how versatile this trailer is. Uh, and then this will be our main cooking for the family on our trip. Yep. We'll be able to cook some in the camper, but we want to cook outside. We want to be outside. Uh, so yeah, did you want to show them yeah. the galley real quick? Yeah. So this galley is really identical, basically exactly identical to the Patriot X1H. So I'll be setting it up the same, pretty similar. We'll do uh, plates and bowls in here. They always have this awesome little nook back here for dishes and dish soap. This pulls out for silverware, knives, whatever you want to throw in there. We've got water. And then as Clay said, the fridge will go right here. And then this will be kind of the prep cooking surface. So we've got the cook partner, stove, a little bit of prep area here. Um, we also have this that to all use this surface. if we need all that surface. We never short a surface on the no. toy hauler. <laughs> no, not at all. Surface is everywhere. Yeah. Um, for most of all of our little spices and stuff, we'll have those in the four-wheel camper. So um, it'll be kind of fun to see what, how I'm going to organize it all. I haven't decided yet. So we'll play with it. It's going to be good. Yep. Right now, this is the, the lower drawer. It's all straps, but it's great. This will probably become food things. Yep. Dry food, chips, snacks. Probably snacks because these yeah. will be easy to get to when we're on the road. On the road, yeah. You just pop, kids can pop this open, they can all reach it instead of crawling into the camper. Yeah. Um, yeah, that'll work great. Cool. So back in here is the command center. Uh, yeah, turn on all your cabin switches, the water pump, the ham radio, uh, which is our accessories. Let's see, so yeah, this can talk to the truck if it leaves, and it can talk to the side-by-side -side if it leaves. So we kind of have a, mm -hmm. be able to communicate with the family, whatever happens there. Yep. Uh, it's all managed also by a Red Arc Manager 30 that's built into this. It's got a uh, big Group 31 AGM battery uh, tucked behind, just behind it there with the air compressor. This has an all air lift system, mm -hmm. uh, which is controlled right here. Turn the compressor on. You can raise and lower, automatic raise and lower the trailer uh, for auto ride height. It's pretty cool. Uh, it's pretty amazing. Right now we have it hooked up to a Red Arc solar panel to pull in power right now. And it's pulling, I think it's a 160 watt panel. And it is pulling in 
currently 72 watts off just sitting on the deck. That's their solar blanket? That's their solar blanket. Okay, yeah. that's awesome. And then also you can check the water levels here as well. So we are full. Yep. Yeah. Up top uh, is just storage. We have a, uh, on the very top, we have a Easy On 1400 series tent. And we may remove that because we've got mm -hmm. a boat coming, uh, a Flycraft stealth boat will be with us mm -hmm. and uh, I want to bring our bigger drone. So we may have to use this area for more of that bigger cargo and we'll put the boys on a ground tent. <laughs> They'll have to set up their tent every day. So we'll see. <laughs> yep. They're young, they're fine. They're young, they're... Let them sleep on the ground. It's part Good of the form. fun. Uh, let's go to the front. Okay. So the front, uh, Justin calls it the man cave and Sure, I, I, I can go with that. Fits a chainsaw, tent poles, all kinds of stuff uh, can go in here. We've, we've hauled fuel, it'll hold jerry cans if you need it. Mm -hmm. uh, holds the Weber grill. They call it the baby Q, but we call it, uh, it's a Q1000. Yeah. And this all tucks away so you can, you can yep. cook with it out here. And then it folds away. Yep, and that's similar locks. to the X1H as Same well. Same as the X1H. And the X1, yeah. This is yeah. my favorite, one of my favorite features on the Patriots, honestly. Yeah. It's so nice. On this side is just bigger storage. And that's where all the helmets will go. That's where oars will go, life vests will go, mm -hmm. etc. It's just three compartments there that we just stuff full of. <laughs> life jackets. Fun stuff. All the things. Well, this is truly a dream setup. And it's because of you guys, thank you so much for supporting the channel and allowing us to build these concept stuff and bring you good stories. So what are you supposed to say as a YouTuber? Like smash that subscribe button, all that crap. Yeah, <laughs> do that, do that stuff, ring a bell, something or other. But thank you so much for supporting us and uh, we'll see you on the next one. We're going to go shoot a show. <laughs>